Hello, I'm Gloria's youngest daughter, Zenda. On behalf of my mother, myself, my siblings, Maria, Armando, Hector, and my two brothers no longer here with us, Chavo and Eddie, we'd like to thank the El Paso Hall of Fame, Athletic Hall of Fame, Ed Stansberry, and of course to Steve Kaplowitz for inducting my father, Salvador Gori Guerrero, to the class of 2020. I'd also like to thank Adrian Ochoa for the wonderful story he did on my father and to Vibrant for the Guerrero's mural in Lincoln Park. You all have read or heard of my father's biography. Let me tell you about the man, my hero, you don't see in writing. My father was a humble, honorable, God-loving man. At the age of 17, he was orphaned. Being the oldest male, along with his older sister, they raised their younger siblings. He began wrestling at a very young age in Mexico to help support his family. He earned the wrestling name Gory by being a wrestler who most always drew blood in his matches. He quickly rose to be one of the more prominent and influential wrestlers to where he invented several wrestling moves such as the Gory Special, later moved on to the Gory Bomb, the Gory Neck Backbreaker, and also the, known as the Widow's Peak, and my favorite, the Gory Flip. He earned the respect of his peers so much so that he even won over his arch rival, Enrique Yanez, and married his sister, my mom, Erlinda. You could say wrestling is a family affair. His fame grew beyond the Mexican borders and he became hugely popular in the United States. The El Paso story starts in 1961 when after leading a nomadic life, my parents fell in love with El Paso and made it our hometown. My father soon began, began, began promoting wrestling, first at the judging arena, then the El Paso Coliseum, and later the El Paso Civic Center. For my father, wrestling was more than a sport more than his economic living. It was a way of life. He used it to promote a healthy way of living by encouraging physical fitness. He used to stay, stimulate a commitment to a work ethic as he included our whole family to work in the business at various levels. Some kids are raised with a swing set in their backyard. We were raised with a wrestling ring. Some of my earliest memories are of my dad encouraging all the neighborhood kids to keep physically fit in our backyard. He wanted to promote a healthy eat, way of eating too, so he was inspired and was instrumental in the creation by a local dairy of a product we all grew up with, El Santo Milk. He is wrestling promotions supported local charities. He and my mother gave their time and money to local causes and they involved us, their family, heavily in church and school activities. I can remember many trips to orphanages in Juarez, free wrestling shows for the soldiers at Fort Bliss, holding wrestling shows to benefit the El Paso Boys Club and many more. It is important to say he continuously worked to promote El Paso in his way of life. He brought the superstars of wrestling to El Paso and Juarez, promoting, promoting all that El Paso had to offer. It was and is a great city, and he took great pride in pointing that out. He was a proud El Pasoan. And a quick note from my beautiful mom, who could not travel due to health reasons. She would like to thank El Paso for being a great city to raise her children, not passing judgment, and always accepting. She has always loved the city and its beautiful people. My father would be humbled and honored by this inclusion into the El Paso Athletic Hall of Fame. We, his family, are so proud of him and grateful to you for this honor. And, in, and to conclude, here's my sister, Maria. This is short, folks. My father was foremost a wrestler, a champion, an athlete, a promoter, a man of faith, a man of a family man, a husband, a father, a grandfather, a brother, a nephew. He was very dedicated to the community. He felt heavily, deeply in, indebted to the community. He contributed greatly to his beloved El Paso 
and to Ciudad Juarez, its sister, the sister city. Thank you. We are deeply honored. And in conclusion, I'd also like to add that I, being a cheerleader, would like to say, Gory. 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 Gory.